Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 3 of Dr. Ellie. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1. Good. <gasps> because we don't need anyone to know. She's got to be treated just as much as anyone else. No, she'll be fine. I think I know that voice. I know that voice. <sighs> Goodbye. I just don't remember who he played. He's played so many characters. Oh, he's pretty. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because, you know, we can't really say, oh, well, complicated. Yes. Make sure you do better next time. Even though there is not a next time for that person, but you can still save someone else's life. Yeah, 
doing common cold something for that. Mm. Well done, because it's experience. <laughs> Graham, you say that, but you so underestimate her. Well, a child like her can do a lot more. <laughs> well, this is the first. You need to make it more, you know sunshiny and lively let some light in here it can't be always depressing and dark uh, there's still so much to do Bringing in positive energy. We love that. Uh oh. It's got to be internal bleeding or something. Right? And he could possibly die. There's no other thing. She has to. Because if you don't do anything, literally, it's like that might turn to gang green, anything worse. We're trying to prevent that. We don't need anyone dying. Definitely need to get his ass some anesthesia, too. Probably. He, he is knocked out, right? Y'all got him some medicine that he ain't gonna feel that shit, right? Oh my god. Okay, no. They gave him anesthetic. Thank god, because if he had to feel all that, I would cry. Quickly. You gotta do this.
<laughs> it always starts with one and the next thing you know I wonder what Graham's going to say about this. Well, we know it's diabetes. Diabetes. I mean, because you were the one who has to watch over. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> She's really tired. Oh. 
but it was the right thing to do. You can't be mad at her. And besides, you probably wouldn't have done anything until it was last minute. Yes. No one did it all herself. Yes, is it that hard to believe? And mainly it's because she's a woman. Right? You're hot, but don't be a sexist asshole. So, But she knows her stuff, though. Mm -hmm. oh. Honestly, who knows? I don't think there is. Oh, you look pretty right there. <laughs> This is going to be the start of a beautiful friendship between these two. Mm -hmm. Diabetes.
Yeah, you can say that. It really might be the best for her. I mean, I would even say, like, let her do both, become Empress and a doctor, but still, that is a lot of work for her to do. And she's only one person. See, I don't even know how I'm going to feel if he goes to see her next week because we know that's going to happen. That's the biggest thing. But is it going to bring back feelings of him being like 100% sure in love with him? With her, really. But for Elise, I mean, seriously, it, it's just she's at a crossroads. She really wants to become a doctor. But, of course, her her beloved or her betrothed wants her to be with him and to, you know, rule the country together. And I get that, but we can't, we can't have the best of both worlds. I mean, I would be okay with that. Like, yes, still becoming a queen, but at the same time also following your dreams about everything else and stuff. But it, it's what she wants to do. And I think she did a damn good job. Yes, she showed up, Graham, and his good-looking behind mouth and self and ish. So, he got what he deserved, but at least he acknowledged it, and he apologized for it, because it's like, damn, like, there, there's mostly, like, a lot of guys in, in just only, not only in anime, but also in the world, who feel like it is the mm, most worthless thing to, to apologize and stuff, and they're like, oh, no, I can't do this because it's, you know, out of my league, or... I, I'm not a type of person to do this, but, like, damn. And he did seem like that for a moment, but I think once he finally apologized to her, we we all looked at him in a different way and such. And so I get it where the fact is he's like, oh, you did all this? Like, you you only been here for how long? And I'm thinking you weren't going to last, like, a day or so. I'm thinking you were going to be here for, like, an hour. And you're like, oh, my God, crying you know, with your tail between your legs and stuff like that. But no, I love the fact that she is literally proving people wrong and being like, yes, I know these terms. I know what this is. I know what that is. I know what to do and such because of her previous life as Aoi. Very, you know, short, long life and stuff. Rest in peace, Aoi. We, you will be missed. But, you know, you get to live again. And I'm so proud of her. Super duper proud of her. And such. Now, the guy, the other doctor that did not really, he knew of the term of diabetes and stuff, but of course he had to go back and do his research just to make sure that it was 100% diabetes. Um, I do want him to meet her, but at the same time, it might cost like her jeopardy or her being found out by anyone. And we're trying to get away from that and such. It's very similar to like season two or really season one and season two of the saints magic powers omnipotent where it's like yeah say is this all-powerful um person and such and this mage and everything but we only want certain amount of kingdoms to know about this and so i think with elise if everyone knows that not only she is the future empress and she wants to be a doctor and she knows all these medical terms oh that's not going to be good for her and such because you know thinking about it is like in, in these times, like, women were not supposed to be, like, doctors and everything like that. And so because she is profoundly different than everyone else and such, she is proving everyone wrong from the get-go. She is stating a claim about herself, which I really do love. And so hopefully in the next couple of weeks, we get to even see even more about that. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode three of Dr. Elise. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. and make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Wednesday for episode four. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.